Very bright. Well, it's getting brighter because we've been here for so long now. <laughs> we've been trying to film this for a little bit. It's overcast, it's bright. All right, it's installed. So we had a person comment on the reveal video and saying that he didn't think that being an electric jack it should be close to gas bottles yeah. for sparks so he didn't think it would be compliant because the gas bottles are over there and the, and the jacks there yeah um the first thing we did was contact titan rv, RV. yep um and talk to them about it and um so do you want me to say it or do you want you to say it? i don't know well they sent out a report yeah you see that okay An independent report so he said titan rv has been working with caravan companies to ensure that this jack was gas Australian gas standard, was compliant with yes, the Australian standard, gas standard. Yeah. However, there were other caravan companies who wanted them to get an independent report done. So they did. They've got an independent report from BIPAC, I think. Is it BIPAC or do you think it's the letters? B-I-P-A-C. BIPAC engineers yeah. and scientists and it's quite an in-depth report we've read it all and they have said that yes it's it's compliant yeah. so there's 26 pages and they done dust tests and water tests and spark tests they don't they don't like yeah. it's really so intense basically what they're saying is a, um, they can't see a spark being, getting released from no, this not the way everything's been double insulated yeah. and you'd have to read this report but it goes yeah, into, yeah you'd be familiar with it yeah so anyhow we're all happy with that we did ring a gas fitter ourselves yeah an independent one an independent somebody yeah we found and talked to him about it all and he has seen uh, a few of these jacks and he said that he was happy with the positioning and everything about it as well and happy with the report happy with the report and um, we emailed that to him and he was happy with that report so as far as we're concerned, we feel we're happy I'm having this I'm jack. Not, I'm not taking it off. <laughs> yeah, having the jack and using the jack. Yeah. Um, the gas uh, fitter did say to us, um, every time we get a new gas bottle to make sure it's not leaking by the yeah, soapy water, soapy test. water test. Um, and he said you could even do that, you know, throughout your travels. Just no, but day, yeah, but going by the report, the, the motors and switches are all double insulated or triple insulated and, and there's no way in the world they'll spark anyway. Yeah, so we're happy. Um, we're going to be testing this out this, this weekend. weekend. Yeah. We're going to the Springs 4x4 park in Queensland. Um, going to catch up with Big Oz Adventurers, Explorers. can't remember their name. Sorry, Chris and Sean. Uh, <laughs> I can't remember their name. Big Oz, anyhow. Everyone knows. Um, Chris and Charm. Chris and Charm. Um, yeah, so we'll be filming this, using it for the first time. However, we're going to drop this video in. Um, we've done our tri our big trip. Yeah. We've come home because I hurt my foot, and yeah. I think we talk about that on the trip. Yeah. I did a lot of damage, so we've had to come home. So our videos are still going to be dropping in for the next few months. But we're going to drop this um, blackjack installation in so you can see it. You can see it was easy to install. So easy. Um, we'll more than likely drop in this week's video, this the video we do this weekend. Yep. Because we'll be using this. For um, the first time, I can't wait. Yeah. But the rest of our videos of our travels for um, the trip we're doing, we don't have this installed. So just know that this is kind of dropping yeah. to show you. Um, we've got a few uh, good weekend trips coming up and we hopefully by October, November, we'll be heading off somewhere again. Again. Um, and doing a longer trip. So yeah, just got to get a internet, a good internet installed on the caravan. We do have one on there, but we've got to try it out. Yeah, because I- um, We just figured out how to actually turn on and use it, so. <laughs> I know. How do you get my um, son up to show us how to do I'm that? I'm now doing um, telehealth nursing remotely, so I can do it anywhere we land. So anywhere we pull up, I should say. Um, yeah, so if you've got any good...
good suggestions for boosters for the internet when we're remote throw them in the comments below yeah, as well we've been watching a lot of reviews on there's so many different types yeah so many and we intend to go we've said before we intend to go places where people don't normally go and do um videos on so i need to have a really really good working internet to do my job yeah yep so anyhow thanks again for i know we've already said it but thanks for watching watching are we going to put this before or at the end here we go again the same thing as the other day I know. um i don't know anyhow guys um continue watching the video and you'll see, see the, the full install, install. It was so yeah. easy yeah keep watching thanks guys no. you did most of the talking anyway hey? <laughs> you did most of the talking anyway my house that lightning on a bloody hey? sun well the sun's mucked us up I know, it'll be yeah. alright, it'll be alright. Except it's bright in my eyes. Oh, you're going to be a little bit. Suck it up, princess. <laughs> so, um, who's walking on it? Anyhow.